Well, so you think you can belly dance? <laughs> we know we can. No, absolutely right? not. So, but there's not a competition, <laughs> right? <laughs> there's a competition coming up though for people who think they can. Yes, yeah, Samantha Karache is the belly diva, and she's joining us now with the details on a very fun competition coming up soon. So you think you can belly dance, <laughs> Samantha? Once again, thanks for uh, coming back on yeah, QCL. Absolutely. So, where did you get the idea for this uh, fun little competition? I mean, I think we've all heard of the show, so you can think you can dance. So I, I think that's probably where you kind of came up with that idea? Yeah, so I was thinking of like dance shows ideas and they have plenty of them and yeah. I was like, what's something I could do here but like a little unique? Yeah. yeah. And so I actually came up with this idea a few years ago and wow. I was like, I should do it but it took a while and then I finally like did it. Yeah. And the first one was in February and it was oh. so successful that I decided to do it again. Wow. Yeah. yeah. That's so. super exciting. Okay, so this next one is coming up next Saturday, mm -hmm. correct? September 28th. So um, for audience members, what can they expect to see at the show? So what they can expect is a lot of colorful costumes, yes. a lot of talent on stage. So pretty much the competition is people that have never belly danced before. Oh, okay. And they all learn for four months with me, oh and then goodness. they compete against each other. So pretty intensive work <laughs> yeah, that they yeah. put in. So pretty brave, brave souls up there. <laughs> so how did you choose the competitors then? Honestly, you can sign up. So we had some sign-ups in the last sure. show. We were like, if you want to do this too, and it was really, there was a lot of people interested. Oh, awesome. So I kept it going, and it's a, Really cool opportunity for everyone. That's so how many people are going to compete next weekend? 12 contestants. 12, okay. That's quite 12, a few. Yeah. yeah, 12 contestants are going to compete. Um, and yeah, so I'm really excited. Yeah, this sounds like fun. Yeah. Like I would love to just be in the audience. And, and just, and yeah, just to watch watching it. Watching like the progression and, and like how people, that's that's great. Yeah. Uh, so who is judging this competition? Because of course it is a competition after yeah, all. Yeah, so my judges are actually my students. So my students oh, yeah. that have been my judges for a long time. Uh -huh. So I actually produce and choreograph the whole show. Wow. And then I kind of, I perform, but I kind of sit out a bit as well too. Yeah. Kind of let them have the spotlight. But yeah, my students are the judges. Some of them have been my students for 12 years. That's amazing. Oh, that's I'll be also having a guest judge as well. So we'll have a bit of a variety for judges, about like seven of them. That's great. Yeah, and you kind of mentioned your performance. So you and your team, the Belly Divas, yeah, will be putting yeah. on a, so my, a nice little performance as well. Yeah, my Belly Divas are performing and I'm performing as well. So we got some showcases in between. So it's yeah. gonna be really fun. Yeah, well, we've uh, been fortunate enough to um, have you on the show in the past. You've yeah. even performed for us on the show. But uh, for folks who may have missed that um, episode, of QCL, just give us a little bit of your background um, and you know how you started belly dancing yeah, in the first place. Yeah, so my background is I started 15 years ago. My mom um, was teaching longer than me, over 30 years, wow. and danced since she was younger. So I picked it up at a young age and pretty much have been doing it since. Um, I'm Jordanian American, so I have a bit of the culture as my background as yeah. well. So yeah, and then I own a dance studio, Rockstar Dance Studio, yeah. in North Park Mall. That's actually where the training has been happening. Taking, yeah, the training for all the contestants. Yeah, that's great. And I will say we were uh, at the mall a couple months ago. I had no idea that you had that spot in the mall, and I saw it. I'm like, what's going on in here? And I saw you all doing your little thing, <laughs> the belly dancing, and it was a uh, it was uh, a sight to see. So I can't imagine what the final product's going to be with. The, so you think you can belly dance? Yes, yeah. yes, I'm excited. Yes, of course. Okay, so uh, let's talk about belly dancing itself because you have actually um, had some really extensive mm. training. You've trained with a lot of different, yeah. um, you know, artists and people that have been doing this for years it's not easy no, no at no, all no. okay so kind of explain to people why it is much harder than it looks well it's definitely hard because you're not doing stuff you regularly do every day with your body right, right? Um, for one you have to learn all these isolations and it's a lot harder than just looking at it. You might see it and they're like, oh, that looks easy, but it's really not once you do it. And I think that's something that all the contestants yeah. learned throughout. Yeah. But like to see them now and when they started. I feel like I would be sore. <laughs> yes. Well, yeah, because yeah, your body has to move all these yeah. uh, certain ways. I feel like you have to really think about it. So what are some things that people may not realize about del belly dancing? So um, it's got like uh, more technique than people I think realize yeah. yep. until like they might see what they see on TV or like Hollywood but there's a lot of technique that goes into it and a lot of training so yeah. like yeah. you said I've trained a lot um, yeah. with a lot of top Egyptian dancers in That's the so field cool. which was really which I was really fortunate and yeah. I still do 
and yeah, so. And going back to your studio as well, because um, you know all these these folks who um, were practicing for these months and are going to be competing next yeah. weekend. Of course, they practiced there and they learned there, but there are plenty of things um, and uh, programs that people can look at uh, participating in at your studio along with that. Yes, yes. Um, actually, some of them have even joined Belly Divas as well, so as oh. students and really found out they liked the dance throughout the process. Yes. Um, but yes, you're free to go on rockstardance.com and you can check out all the stuff we do. We're always doing something. <laughs> yeah, absolutely, absolutely busy, busy, are. busy. Yes, they follow along on yes. Facebook and they are busy. Well, the show itself, again, Saturday, September 28th at the Walcott Coliseum. Doors open at 6 p.m. Performances begin at 7 and you can get your tickets. They are on sale now at rockstardance.com. Com. And uh, we're, we're not letting go yeah, yet, Yeah, no, right? not, not yet. Next on QCL, Belly Diva Samantha. She's going to be back with the performance for us.